Hello, Nene Jarvis. We're so glad you're here. Oh, hi, Janine. How are you? How's it going? I saw I got an email from you, but I have not had a chance to open it up yet. It's been kind of a busy day, but I'm excited to look at it. Your sweets here. We're so glad. Thank you. We're so glad all of you are here. This is obviously different than what we normally do. We. I love how I say we. <laughs> yeah, we normally are doing scars. We normally are designing. So um, this is a major experiment here. I have no idea how this is going to go down. Or if it's going to be tragic, I don't know. So Victoria, this is your second live. Do not judge us on this one. We'll see what happens. <laughs> we'll Come see. back. All right. So I'm going to attempt it hat, but I have no idea if the bowl that I'm use, doing it in, I couldn't find one that was the size that I wanted. Um, so I just kind of made the carrageenan a little lower and I'm hoping that when I go to dip the hat that it doesn't just all overflow. But I have mats on the ground, so hopefully. <laughs> all right, here it goes. I'm a little nervous. So for those that are just, what is going on here? Oh, I should here, show our bucket. So yeah, show them the... I'm gonna attempt, I already dropped. One or so I'm gonna attempt a bucket hat. And we've had this come up in our lives and people yeah. wanted you to try people it. People so. have been asking, we're so we're it. trying it and I soaked it in alum and dried it ahead of time. So we're gonna see what happens. So Sherry Moore, usually we're doing what's underneath the tray. After we do this one, we're gonna be doing a um we'll be doing the large scarves, right? Yeah. Okay. All right, so explain what you're doing i guess yeah well we're gonna attempt to to marble a bucket hat and oh so yeah yeah they're asking what are you doing okay yeah. so this is water that is thickened with carrageenan and i've got some artist quality acrylic paints that we're just dropping on the water so we are marbling we love and mia wants or mila wants to know how much uh, how much time does it take to dry? Not too long, really. I haven't dried a hat yet, so I'm not sure how long that'll take. But um, scarves take about an hour. Joy Joyful Creations is here, and TikTok is acting up tonight. Oh, no. It is? I hope it gets it. Well, how do you get the comments to go away? Uh, I think there's an arrow. Well... I think yeah, I do believe you can turn yeah, you them can hit off. Yeah, you can arrow. And you can mute me if you want. Don't mute Jen. <sighs> and our question for tonight, so we try to throw out a question to go along with um, just different one every night. Uh, and tonight's question is, what is your favorite childhood toy? Favorite childhood toy? Oh, we got all kinds of people helping how to get rid of the comments. Oh, good. I know there's a way to turn them off. Volvo Regeer. Let's see, was that? No. Regar wants to know, can I buy all the used gloves? Oh, well, I, I did have somebody that asked me. I don't know if you were the one, but I am saving them. So I'm happy to um, save them for you. Check. Just message me. Jacqueline Dennis likes Lincoln Logs. Terry oh, yeah. Goodman, Cabbage Patch Dolls. That was a big one. Did you have that? Oh, yeah. You did? Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, what else we have? Etch-a-Sketch. Yep. Barbies. Barbies and Weebles. Oh, someone knows about Weebles. Weebles oh, wobble, but they wow, won't fall down. Yeah. That's, that's a really that's old awesome. one. Nintendo. Ooh, Kittens 1992 likes Wood Burning Kit. Stretch Armstrong, there we go, another one. I like that. Plastic Horses, Trolls, G.I. Joe, Light Bright. Yeah. A toy refrigerator with small fruits. That was one of our <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. The light up pegboard. Yeah. Oh, they still use we Weebles at our daycare. That's awesome. Wow. Popples, Polly Pockets. Yeah. Oh, wow. Our girls. This is great. Gumby. 
Ugh. Cass Marie, that's awesome. Tonal Toys. The question of the day is, what is your favorite childhood toy? Another Stretch Armstrong. Rock and Sock'em Robots. That's a great one, too. Mm -hmm. My Little Pony, Light Bright. Violet, what was yours? The Potato Head. The what? The Potato Head. Oh, Violet's was Mr. <laughs> potato Head. Yeah, Violet Mom. is in the room. Treasure Trolls, Radio Flyer. Oh, the Cricket Doll. Smurfs. Cricket Lemon Doll. Lemon Twist, yeah. Rocket Power, oh, Rocket Power, Big Ace 34. Is that the one that you would stomp with your foot and it would go up in the air? Oh, Easy Bake Oven. Never turned out just right on the Easy Bake Oven. Okay, I have no Strawberry idea what's show. gonna happen here, oh so All right. I'm afraid. <laughs> drum, drum roll. All right, so this. I'm afraid I'm just gonna even drop it in the water. Okay, Let's so see. here's our hat. Well, what's underneath the hat? Tell them what it's, you're doing. Oh, I have a. Your secret. A see if this works. And it is. It's a little deflated, so I'm hoping that that's gonna help me grasp. A hold of it because I'm afraid it's just gonna slip out of my hands. Hold it for Mr. Armstrong, edges. Stretch Armstrong, creepy crawlers. Ooh, love that. You should just hold it from the edges. Yeah. All right, here we go. Try that. So live viewers want to know what would happen if you did a bucket hat, and here we go. Okay. Is it gonna go all the way in? I don't know. I don't know if it is gonna go all the way oh, in. Oh boy. All We're right. We're gonna see. We're yeah. just experimenting here. Even if it doesn't get the rim. Ooh. It may not have gotten the whole room. Let's see. Oh, it did. It did. All right. Well, that's yeah, that's fun. That's fun. Wow, it worked. Wow, so it turned out real vibrant on the top, and then it ended up being a little bit lighter on the edges, but that's kind of fun. That is. It works. So I think if I had a bigger. Just a little bit bigger bowl or bucket. Um, I think that maybe the edges would have come out even cool, better. cool, Rad. That's amazing. So, yes, my, my first goodness, time ever trying yeah. this. <laughs> this, was, this was experimenting in front Total of you guys. experiment. We are not the high-tech so, live, so. Yeah, that, yeah, not bad for the very yes. first time. Yeah, so, yeah, you're right. So, a little bit bigger and... Yeah. Just so it could hit all the way. Yeah. Kind of fun. All right. Yeah. So. Thank you I'm for gonna... sharing that with the experience yeah. with us. So you guys got to see the experiment <laughs> live. And all now right. she's going to. I'm going to oh. let it dry. All right. So now she's going to switch over. And then what she's going to do next is she's going to the tray. And she is going to um, be water marbling on the tray. So she's just moving her stuff here. And what this is, it's the ancient art form of Ebru, E-B-R-U. Oh, what, what, was, what uh, material was the bucket hat made of? Mystery 71. It was um, canvas. Okay. Yeah, canvas. Canvas. All right, so what she's doing is um, it is water marbling, again, okay, from Turkey, Ebru. And what she's doing is she's taking acrylic paints, they're artist quality acrylic paints, She's going to be dropping them on top of water. The water's thickened with a carrageenan. Um, it's a seaweed extract. And so there's her tray. Ta-da. And then uh, she will then manipulate the paint to make a design. And then she will lay a silk scarf right on top. And that design will immediately adhere. I'm just be ready to go. adding a little more carrageenan to it. Do you have a site that can buy products? She does. Yeah, it's blueivymarbling.com. Oh, some people want to see, they're asking to see you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're asking uh -oh. for Violet? Oh, Violet, you're going to Oh, have to so show your Janie face. MJ says, okay, now that proves any canvas, shoes, backpacks, because we yes. do get those questions. Yes. So. Yep. Well, I knew that you could do the shoes, and oh, thanks for that hat gift. Um, I knew that you could do the shoes, and uh, that's why I really want to do a canvas tote. 
because a talk. lot of people have asked for that. Yeah. The tricky part is if it's already sewn together, trying to do it on the front and back. So that's the part I don't have figured out yet. Penny Ferguson would like to know, do you modify your paints with anything like water or anything? Yeah, I use a lot of heavy bodies, some fluid acrylics, and they're all thinned down with water. And um, some of them you I put in a little surfactant. Oh, Melissa Haskell noticed. Thank you for shopping at Home Depot. <laughs> oh, really? That was on the stirring stick. Oh, See, yeah. look at, see, Home see, Depot can sponsor our wanna, lives. Yeah, yeah as you caught on. They're not. If they were, we have to, like, put something out there, Does I think. Does anyone bummer? Yeah. Well, tell go out and come back in, it gets a little better is what they're saying. Okay. Should I go ahead and end it? Okay, I'll end no, it. No, not you. Oh, not me. Don't so end other it. No, they're saying oh, other people. Oh, okay. Sorry. Hmm. Okay. So now I'm going to... Um, Try double marbling a scarf because I didn't like, um, I didn't love the colors. The first time I wanted them to be a little bit more vibrant. This green turned out nice, but the orange didn't turn out the way I wanted to. I just wanted to make the scarf a little bit more vibrant. So I soaked it in alum again after marbling it. And now I'm going to See what, you never know with double marbling what's going to happen. Like, I, I really don't know. So, I'm just going to try it and see if I like it better. All right. We're getting a lot of people said it was TikTok's been having problems all afternoon. Oh, so man. So, they said it's not us. Okay. All right, so, she's just getting the tray ready, and then we're going to be ready to go here. I am ready. You are ready. Oh, all right. So we're doing a double marble. And the question of the night is your favorite childhood toy. Favorite childhood toy of all times. You know what? I'm, I'm giving a shout out to BK Daniel because I agree. She says, I love that everyone is so nice and helpful on your lives. Um, Our audience is awesome. Yes. They even catch when we make mistakes. Oh, Tracy's here. Hi, Tracy. And they also, if if that one person isn't kind, everybody's like, get out of here. Because <laughs> <laughs> only niceness here. Pound puppies. Furby. I forgot about Furby. That Oh, that was all the rage, yeah. too. Yeah. It was like that first, like, robot kind of doll. Barbie. Barbie kid. Barbie had so many different things. I was always jealous of it. Barbie's oh, kind of timeless. Yes. So Amber Brogdon wants to know, what inspires your designs? I love them. Gosh, well, a lot of it is just truly just random. Like, as I'm standing here, just what I feel like colors might look nice together. And I just experiment with different designs. But then sometimes people will challenge me, like I'm trying different flowers. And so I'll look at pictures and try to see what I can come up with that way. So a lot of different ways. So a lot of a lot more answers to the question, what's your, fa what's your favorite childhood toy? Beanie Babies, Easy mm -hmm. Bake Oven, Teddy Ruxpin, Puppy Surprise, Donkey Kong. Ooh, Donkey Kong 64. Is that a Nintendo 64? Probably. That's awesome. Holly Hobby's oven set. Oh, oh I didn't know about a Holly Hobby oven set. I didn't have the oven wow. set. I had the Holly Hobby doll. Slinky. <laughs> <laughs> That's timeless. Too. It is timeless. That is. Oh, there we go. Evil Knievel's girlfriend on a motorcycle wind up. I love <laughs> Evil Knievel wind up motorcycle. Was that is that's my favorite. That's but it. I did like the Hot Wheel racers too. I would have fun with that. Gigapet, Buzz and Woody. Oh, Simon. Yes, Simon. Yes, yeah, Simon's another timeless one. The light bulbs. That's Deedles fifty. One of your subscribers. Oh, Light, good. Yeah, likes Light Bright. That's great. Who did? Oh, was it 
And thank you for subscribing. Yeah, that is That is good. such a yes, huge help, you. and I just want you to know how grateful I am. Grumpy Cat liked Pet Rock. California Raisins. SMR loving. California, California Raisins. Raisins. Yeah, I remember the California Raisins singing and everything, but you must have had the oh, dolls of them. Yeah, I didn't Etch know a sketch. That. Smurf figures. Clackers. Oh, that's hilarious. American Girl dolls. Chia pets. <laughs> <laughs> Rock'em Sock'em. Man, there's a lot here. Oh, boy. We are so glad you are here. Parasophilus. Sophilus. Oh, I found you guys again. I haven't seen you guys since oh, February. Good. Oh, Better thanks back. for that musical gift there. How do you make the flower design? It's so pretty. So they like that one, I think, maybe straight back or the other yeah, one. Well, that's... both of them. That's making a, like, dropping paints and creating a background and then um, putting drops on top and then manipulating it. Kind of hard to explain. Tamiya, oh, so pretty. Baby Alive. That was oh, a big one, too. I have Baby Alive, yeah. Yes. I like the colors. So she's got... You'll have to show that uh, scarf again yeah, before we I'll lay it down. So we're, I'm uh, doing a double marble. You so never know how the double marble is going to turn out. You are just chock full of experiments on the thir yeah. our therapeutic Thursday. Why not? But Grace uh, Jong SK says this is so relaxing. Oh, well, we're doll. glad you're here. Paisley Elizabeth says you must be a master of the um, flowers. I do love doing flowers. I do a lot of different kinds, and they're just fun. Amber Brogdon says, this should be called Autumn Fields. I like that. Oh, yeah, I do like that. Really like the designs. Oh, okay, almost done. Miss Personality 100. Yes, my uh, stress level has gone down. Oh, good. Dropped. Uh, so when you finish, what clothing are you making in? Uh, so or what's... this is going to be on a silk scarf. So I'm going to have Violet help me lay it down. Now, um, uh, your uncle dropped it the other night. So that's why we're double marbling, <laughs> because this is a mistake that I made. No, this isn't the mistake. Oh, it's not? This one I just oh. wanted to redo. This that's... isn't the mistake. Okay. But, yeah. Uncle Tom Cruise. <laughs> yeah, Uncle Tom Cruise. <laughs> Okay, so we are gonna. Oh, here, let's show it. So this is the. Hold on tight. That's the front side, and I'm gonna. You can marble it on the same side, or you can do the back side. So, I, I guess we could take a vote really fast. Should I do it over the front, or should we do it on the back, which is lighter? Really faded. Hmm. Yeah. Naomi. Front or back? Says suddenly Don't. I'm craving a uh, pumpkin spice. <laughs> So should we mar double marble the front, Ooh. or should we go for the back? Oh my gosh! Let's not. We're we about fifty-fifty. A lot 50, of fifty-fifty. Ah uh, no, it's backs. Yep, you're getting a lot of backs. More Davidson. for the back. Yeah, there okay. is. We'll try it. Honestly, yep. We will I was going to vote happens. front too, so. Okay, we'll do the back. All right. Okay, hold on tight. Another Towards experiment. Towards me, just a little bit. Yep, there we go. Okay, we're going for it. So you won't, you can't really tell what it'll look like until we take it off the water. All right, so she's going to get the edges. And Actually, the weight. I don't really need to because they were already kind of done. On this side? Yeah, it's pretty oh, much got paint okay. all over. Well, yeah, right. because the front was already oh, done. Oh, that's right. That's right. So. Were you ever we're an see. artist or an art, art teacher? No, I had no art background before I started this um, 10 years ago. And I should say too, when you do double marbling, it kind of gives a really cool 3D effect. Yeah, we've had, oh, I like that. Whoa, look at that. Here, so I'm to... not sure how well you can see what your shirt. 
Yeah. Yeah, I think they can. The so, lines. So yeah, wow. it's kind of cool when you. I like that one. Double it like that. Hey, that. Uh, yeah, can you tell it's like 3D? How it's over, isn't it yeah. cool? The, uh, yeah, the, the, lots of wows, beautiful. Oh, thanks. Yeah, see, people ask like, what do you do when you make a mistake? Well, the, it wasn't really a mistake the first time, but I just wasn't thrilled with how it looked. So I just thought I would try it again. And now I definitely like it better. So this one will be available tomorrow. If anybody's, well, if anyone is interested, you can message me. One cool mama says it looks like Etch-A-Sketch. And tonight we were talking about our favorite <laughs> toys. Yeah. There's a couple Etch-A-Sketch fans out there. Do you make other items besides scarves? Yes, I um, do um, bandanas, I know that. bandanas, and um, I'm going to start offering bucket hats. Um, leather cuffs, leather earrings, ornaments. Uh, ceramic ornaments, leather wallets. Victoria Sterlinger says no mistakes, just happy accidents. Yeah. That's a favorite mom quote. We did yep. mom quotes on Tuesday. <laughs> Had that Tuesday night, yeah. Violet, do you want to help me op open it up and show yeah. it? It says, do I make scrunchies or do you make scrunchies? I don't make them, no. Um, do you make scrunchies? Yes, yeah, that was one quote. No, I would mom. love to, but I would need to lay the fabric down flat and then have somebody sew it for me. All right, that yeah, is that. very, very different than anything that you've done. I really like yeah. that. Wow. Okay, I'll have you go to the end so we can show it off. Thanks. Yeah. Fingers down. Kind of cool. So the um, so I'm gonna leather wallets, this. how much do those usually go for? Oh gosh, I'm not Putting on the spot. sure offhand. Yeah, they, I'm not sure offhand, but I'm hoping to have those within the next few weeks because um, I know they're going to go well for the holidays. Returner 360 said they're pretty easy to sew. Oh, actually, wow. Uh, sewing those is not, she does, she hand sews hers. The, the wallets. Yes. I hand sew the wallets. Yeah, that is. Um, so I know you're not an artist, but scrunchies? you are a perfectionist. <laughs> so yeah. that has really helped with this art form. But you don't have to be a perfectionist with this art form. No, you don't have to be. No, you can just you can be wild and fun too. Not that you're not wild and fun. I'm not wild and fun. You are fun. wild and fun and a perfectionist all at the same time. <laughs> Okay, did you just <coughs> rinse it in water? Yeah, it okay. was just um, purified water. Now I'm just using a piece of wood to gather up the excess paint off the surface. Paisley Elizabeth says you should try selling some scrunchies with what you're doing. Uh, yeah, I just need to find a seamstress because I just don't have time to figure that part of it out. Haley Lawrence six, uh, can you do aprons? It's... Um, it could, if I had a big enough tray, I right. could. Oh, wraps for formals. That's a good idea. Oh, yeah. Yeah, someday when I have a bigger space, I'll have a bigger yeah, we'll tray. Do that. Yeah. So she's not using alcoholic, sorry, alcoholic, alcohol ink. She's using acrylic paints. Uh, user 409837384. It's, um, Artist quality acrylic paints. That's what she's doing. And she uses a variety um, just because every color acts a little different. So she really works with her colors. Um, you don't have to do that. She just happens to do it. Just sit, um, find some work easier in certain colors than others. Who's that man? Um, <laughs> Was that one? Um, well, I guess. Violet shows that I had to like show who I was, so that's fine. Okay, one more and I'm ready to go. Hmm. Well, I'm not getting. Better hurry, you're missing I their comments. I am missing their comments. All right. That's me. 
I'm the guy behind the camera. That's who I am married to her. I am no way endorsing her product. This is simply just me showing you who's behind the camera. Okay, this one we can, since we're experimenting tonight, um, we'll let the viewers choose. Hey, I'm getting a lot of flowers before we even oh, we really? do that, that. Flowers? Um, table runners, she does uh, do the same ones. Thanks for that gift, that's awesome. <laughs> oh. I, yes, I do table runners. Oh, this tiny you. message you wants that last scarf. Oh, okay, awesome. I love the gifts. Those are so fun. All right. We're doing flowers? I think, yeah. Let's but see. maybe the colors. Okay, so let's do flowers, and then we're going to throw out some colors. Okay, we need a background color. Hmm. They like fall colors. Some fall. But red, white, bit. and blue for the queen. Because the queen passed away today. Oh, uh, yeah, I did hear that. Um, let's see. Queen of England. Oh, the Commonwealth. Yes. Wait, Queen Elizabeth, Elizabeth just yes. Away? Yeah. Oh, that's sad. BK Daniels, very nice. You both just sound like such genuinely kind, nice people, and I love your art. Aww, I think they're talking you about so you and much. Anthony Jenny. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Thailand. All right, so they, let's see. We're getting, oh, what colors are you doing? Well, I just thought for fall we'd do a okay. green background. Green? Are you going to do orange? Because we're getting requests orange. for orange. Do you want orange yeah. in the flowers? Yeah. Okay. Oh, orange table runner good. for Halloween. She's going to do flowers. Oh, I can do that as a <laughs> um, custom order. I can do a Halloween table runner. Okay. And we could do that on the next live, too. That's a good idea. Maybe you should add purple, blue, or pink to this. Okay, so orange. Oh, purple. mad thick. Happy birthday, but that stinks. You tested positive for COVID. Oh, Hopefully no, that's not a okay. fun birthday present. Getting leopard pattern. Leopard pattern. That yeah, leopard does not work with this art form. Yeah. Some Good morning from Indonesia. Good morning. Lots We're like going to be heading you. to bed in a couple hours. Yeah, they're just starting their day. Thank you for all the follows and the shares. Wondering about leaves too. You, she can do leaves. I can do leaves. I wasn't prepared for that on this particular okay. scarf. So Brunei is um, here. But I can do leaves. Yeah. Uh, let's see, Elizabeth uh, Eleven. This is from M Little Sixty Four. Red, orange, and yellow are good fall colors. What about? Do you have like a magenta ochre? Yes. And we orange. Have. Do we have that? With Not that magenta. What am I saying? Like orange. a maroon. Orange. Like dark red, like this. Ochre. Maybe? I'm putting you on what the spot that? because you may not have. Yeah, you are. Just to work out her paints. I can do, yeah, those would look nice together. Okay. All right. Lots of people following. I can do the rusty pink or a magenta. Either one of those. Another rusty pink, okay. Pumpkins. Can you do pumpkins? I, I think I could do a pumpkin-ish look. Pumpkin-ish, <laughs> all right. Abstract. Abstract. Chili's here again. Awesome. Morphix here from Idaho. Great. It's great. Okay. All right. So we're, she, what, So for those that are new, because we have people to leave and come back on um, and join, so she is doing the, uh, this is the art form Ebru, E-B-R-U. She's dropping acrylic paints, artist quality acrylic paints on top of the water. The paints are floating. She is thick in the water with carrageenan, which is a seaweed extract. And she is gonna manipulate it to make a design. She is going to be making flowers. Um, and so she is going to be using, what color is orange for the flowers? Orange, orange ochre. Orange, ochre, and, and um, a rusty pink, probably the rusty pink. Rusty pink, okay. Good morning, Philippines. And good evening, Florida. 
And the way these are opening, I think they're going to be rather large flowers. UK is a flag. Maybe we'll do that next week. We're not going to have time tonight. So the art form is Ebru, E-B-R-U. It's a Turkish art form. Jen was um, uh, trained by a woman from Turkey, from Istanbul, uh, in Chicago. She had moved to Chicago. And how did you get started and why? Why, why are you doing this business? Um, so that's well, a good, that's a deep I just, question. yeah, I just took an interest in it when I saw it and just thought it was so cool and wanted to learn. So I took classes and um, really wanted to have my own business um, so I could stay home. And so it was just one thing led to another and uh, I just loved sharing it and I love that people just get so excited about it that they just feel like like it helps with anxiety and feels therapeutic to watch and so I just I just have fun with it and so I just decided I wanted to stick with it. Well Molly Stevens is glad to oh, be here and says hi, hey Molly. and miss you guys. We miss you. Cat fam life. Oh, cat fam for life. You do a wonderful job at your job. That's uh, very nice. Thank you. Okay, I'm trying to make these a little bit. She bright. does ship These are like worldwide. majorly growing. What's that? Oh, Israel. Pine Guatemala. Looks like a pineapple upside down. Hello, Guatemala. Uh, That's awesome. In these Indonesia. are like old, gigantic flowers. We're going crazy tonight. Ooh, most definitely satisfying. So ordering, she has a website, blueivymarbling.com, blueivymarbling.com. She has these long scarves. She has short uh, bandanas. bandanas. She has long table runners like this. Uh, she has leather cuffs, leather earrings, and she's going to be adding more to her website. She's constantly working on that. And right now... Somebody wanted okay. to see flowers. I'd say put one more in the middle. Yeah, I'm just doing the pink one. From from time. observer over here. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, the fabrics to dry once she um, dips them. Scarves oh, take what an hour? About an hour. An yeah. hour. Table runners are thicker. They're still silk, but those take maybe about what two hours, double the time. Uh yeah. About that. And so her okay, website again is get more and more vibrant as I add here. Blueivymarbling.com. It's and there's a link in her TikTok bio. All right, we're gonna go with that. All right, these are gonna be big flowers. That's the other thing about this art form. You just never know exactly what you're gonna get. So you can see in the back there's she she can do little, medium, big flowers. But sometimes the paints decide what they want to do. Depends on how thick the water is. So we enjoy doing these lives and just like the peaceful music and just, well, it's Thursday for us. It's Friday morning for some people, but therapeutic Thursday. So do different pigments behave differently? Oh, they very much do. That's why you have to prepare each paint individually. You can't just follow one recipe for all of them. So she does custom orders, blueivymarbly.com. Um, she also has scarves that she puts up there to sell. The cost is between 55 to 65. And someone wants to know, what are you gonna do with that one red dot? <laughs> I'm just gonna blend it in. Oh, let's see, all right. I could, I could take it out, but I thought I'm just going to blend it in there. I did also create a course um, for people that want to learn how to do it that walks you through the whole thing. See, it kind of make when you go through a circle, it makes a heart. So we've got a little heart hidden in this flower. And the cost of her course, it's, it's 99 is the cost. And I teach you how to prepare the sizing, that's the water and the paints and your material and give all of my tips and tricks after years of learning. 
Does the water have to be a specific temperature? A uh, room temperature is best. And they want to know is uh, this is it's unknown, Melly. Is it easy to make? What's that? What you're doing, like, I guess making doing doing what you're doing. Well, there is a lot involved. Um, it's like a science experiment where the water has to be just the right thickness. Um, paints have to be just the right consistency. So um, there's a lot involved to getting paints to float right on the water. So I'd say the biggest thing is you have to be just adaptable and understand that it's it's an art form that just... And patient with it. Yeah. And it's definitely something that you just get better with over time. But you've gotten great comments from people who have taken the course and have had success and enjoy yeah. it. And it's yeah. just... The whole idea is just to enjoy and it's just relaxing to do. All right, Violet, we can lay this one down. All right. <laughs> We're uh -huh. putting Violet to oh, sleep. Oh no, Violet's falling asleep. We can't have Violet fall asleep. <laughs> she's like, she's getting lost in it. The water, okay, hold on tight. The water All is right. thickened with carrageenan. Yeah, that's perfect. Okay, we'll go ahead and lower it down. This one is also available if anybody's interested. Ooh. You can message me. Zen Jen said she's gonna take, they're gonna take the course. Oh, good. And you can also, I have a place on there where you can ask questions. So I try to make sure that you just leave feeling like you can totally, and uh, Nene Jarvis, I think, I'm not sure if that's your handle exactly, yeah. but she's on here all the time. She has taken the course, she's built the tray, She and she's, she's been having asking great- She's questions. Yeah, and, she's yeah, asking questions, great. and I'm trying to help along the way, and she's doing amazing with it. Um, so lives, I'm sorry, I lost your name, you got away. So we try to go lives on Tuesdays and Thursdays. We may switch to Monday, Thursday. And then we try to hit the weekend, maybe Saturday morning. We may be on the Saturday morning. And, and occasionally, sometimes I will pop on in the morning too. I did pop on earlier today for a little bit when I was doing a couple of custom orders. So yeah, now it looks more vibrant now that you see the other Ooh. side. Watch your shirt. Yeah, I like that. That's how we do some flowers. Now we just give it a rinse in water here. They like it, yep. Beautiful. Thanks. Bright and beautiful, so pretty. She can make tulips, that's one of the things she does. Yep, I do tulips. Tulips, cherry blossoms. But just so you know, red is, I can't do red tulips because red is a really oh. difficult color and it grows too big to stay in tulip form. <laughs> we have a lot of different artists that, and all kinds of different, uh, from canvas painting to just ceramics yes. and all things. And they, oh, every single off, artist. Yeah, says the same that. thing. Red's the hardest color to work with. Okay. Oh, did you look up Calia Lilies? We have that written down. Oh, Jenny yeah, wrote that I have down that, for that you, right? on the list. Yes. Yep. We'll do that on a live. Oh, we will? <laughs> oh, sorry. Yes, we will do that. I have to make sure hey, I can do them first. If you're willing to do the bucket hat, you know, as an experiment and double to, marble. I have to look at them. Oh, okay. TikTok, uh, Tiki Mom one. Uh, she did. She she created a PVC pipe contraption. Oh, that's fun. See, I like that. Yeah. Those are big, bold fla uh, flowers. Yeah, I like the big, bold ones. Returner Thank 360 you. says I can sew scr uh, scrunchies. Oh, really? Hmm. Oh, well. Maybe we need might to connect to there. Think about that. Yeah. yeah. Okay, I'll be back. Crosses. Um. Same. And no, because you can't do lines, lines. like yeah. that. Yeah. It doesn't stay in that form. So you can see when she's dropping the paint on, it is a flower. Oh, sorry, a flower. It is a, a circle. No matter how she drops it in, it's going to spread open like a circle. So it's just either bigger or smaller. 
So that's what's prohibitive of wines and it grows while it's still on the tray. Constantly growing. Try pumpkins. Yeah, okay. Mackenzie, Mackenzie just wants you to try pumpkins try maybe pumpkins. the next time. I'll show you one. I haven't ironed this yet. This one I did on the live earlier today. Just also going for some fallish colors. Yeah. This will be available tomorrow after I get it all ironed and softened up. So, well, thank you everybody so for being much. here. Yes. We had fun. It was fun Great trying crowd. a bucket hat. So, I will uh, be working on that for sure. So thanks for all of the wonderful comments and just the sharing and the likes. Like always, we just appreciate all of you. So thank you so much. Oh, Nene Jarvis watched you today. Oh, live good. During oh, the you day. did? Oh, good. Paper is awesome. a good way to practice too. That yes, is. paper is definitely a great that. way to practice. That's what I have in my starter kit. Tons of likes some... and following at the last minute. Thank, thank you, you so much, everybody. We'll see you soon. Thank you.